housing projects we have in Davis County. But the newest one we have is going to be called Beaver Dam Village, which is going to be here in Beaver Dam uh, off of Rochester Road. It'll be a development that will have uh, 40 uh, senior housing units uh, that will be developed here. They are, they are targeted for low-income seniors, um, which uh, the actual terminology in the, in the grant or in the housing market is the elderly, uh, low, very low and low-income uh, 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 seniors. Um, the facility itself is a, a $5.3 million investment here in Ohio County. Uh, it will it, it will provide, uh, in addition to the services of the actual housing, uh, there will be uh, a community center there that the uh, seniors can use and it can be used for other kinds of related services. Audubon will be providing as a support service right within the community in the Beaver Dam Village uh, we will provide uh, social service support for uh, the, the seniors and uh, to uh, have people there with, well, there's a meeting facility and there are offices there uh, that we'll, we'll be occupying as well. Um, I can't show you here, but I'll... Uh, um, okay, so, uh, so I've told you a little bit about the basic facts. A couple of things that, that you some I've already had some questions about. Uh, the housing itself is subsidized housing, so you have to be low income to, to be eligible for the housing. And the rents uh, will run, based upon our experience from other similar housing we have in Davis County, will run about, the individual will pay about $400 to $475 uh, a month would be the rates. When will this be finished? It'll basically, uh, <clears throat> we, don't, we don't have the exact figures. We're still in the process of, of uh, finishing the designs and the, the, the process of getting final approval from the Kentucky uh, Housing Corporation. But it basically, uh, we hope to have it finished within a year. So uh, given the track record of Walbuck Development Corporation, they are also the, uh, the construction, uh, have a construction firm, and they will be the one uh, completing the construction of the facility. So we're really excited about it. I think it has a lot of potential for, uh, for the county and for the program as well. It will have primarily one and two bedroom homes. Uh, it will be uh, situated around uh, complexes uh, that uh, sort of, let's see if I can get this one up, uh, that sort of look like this. These will be, there will be five or six of these complexes, a uh, general uh, outlay of the, of the, the bedrooms and then uh, a community center as well. Um, so we're excited about that. Any questions about that um, before I share a few other things? Yeah, this be very similar to the President's Place we have over in Lundgren right now? It'll be very similar. Um, President's Place is a senior housing facility in Davis County, uh, also completed by Walbuck and uh, been in operation now for over a year. One of the great things, and you know, of course, the need is here. Uh, you could not get the grant if it were not if there wasn't an established need within the county, and so that's a, that's a, a big plus. And then the other thing that we have found is that uh, we operate a lot of different types of housing for low-income folks, but the senior housing is always the one that stays full. We always end up with an extensive waiting list for senior housing, and, uh, and and never have any problem with occupancy, which is a key a factor. This is a, what's called a tax credit facility meaning that it is built with tax credits. There are some basic funding that comes from the, the uh, Ohio uh, Housing, of, uh, the Ohio, Ohio Housing uh, Loan uh, Association, the bank, and then we have some from KHC. But the bulk of the cost of it is paid through tax credits, which individuals uh, pay money, they get credits on their taxes, and then you pay that back, that pay that back to those individuals from the receipts of the of the housing development over a 15 year period. So um, again, uh, an exciting announcement. Let me just share a couple of other things uh, about uh, Audubon, some other services that are, are in Ohio County that you may not have even associated with Audubon sometimes. The first one. Is